Hello. In this video tutorial, we will show you how to install Kids WordPress theme. For this, first of all, please go to your hosting cPanel and create MySQL base. Click on MySQL and write name of uh, your base. In our case, it will be Kids. Click Create Database, has been created. Then we should create for this base user. For example, it will be, for example, George. Oh, no, no, George, I have already George. Uh, we should create a new username, for example, Tom and write password you like. And then create user. User has been created. Now, third step is we should give access, uh, for example, where is our kids? Here is kids. Base which we have created. Now we should find Tom. It is user Tom. We should give to this user access on this base, full access, all privileges, and click Make Changes. That's all. Base has been created, user has been created. Now we should install template. For this, please go again in cPanel and click File Manager. Then click public HTML if you would like install your template in the root of your server, you should do it here. But we will install it in WordPress and Kids folder here. What we should do for starting installation? We should upload installation package. We should find it in our computer. Just a moment, should find it. Uh, it is here, yes. And upload installation package, first and second one to installer PHP2. Should wait <coughs> a few seconds. Everything is OK. Now we can click go back to the folder. Here is now we should uh, we should use correct the URL address. It's test demo.com. In our case, uh, it's WordPress and kids. Click. As you can see, here is two files, one uh, zip package and second file is installer. Please click on installer PHP file and use uh, username of your base. Uh, as, as I know, just a moment, we should find again user. User uh, is Tom. Yes, yes, user is Tom. Just a moment, go here, click name, then name of base, sorry, name of base, name of base is kids, and user is Tom, and password, I know, this is, then check, I have read all warning and notices, and click on test connection. As you can see, connection is correct, success, success, Close and click on Run Deployment. OK, and should wait. Should wait a few seconds or minutes. Minutes. It depends how fast your server is. Now we should click on Run Update, and that's so. Click on File Cleanup.
as you can see <clears throat> we it has been installed successfully and it works fine that's all thank you bye